Snow keeps coming and it has a lot of powder lovers packing the canyons to get fresh tracks and it has a lot of the skiers packing the buses to caravan to the resorts. Yeah, traffic specialist Katia Stepovic spoke with a ski bus driver on what they're seeing with these recent storms. For me, seeing the white stuff is like Christmas Day. Just weeks ago, many skiers were wondering if their Christmas wishes would ever come true. But today, ski bus operator Joshua Mamea is saying better late than never. Seeing the people, that's what I love the most is having people on my bus, having it being full, even better. And full is what most of his trips up the canyons have looked like as skiers anxiously awaited powdery conditions. With our park and rides being as full as they are, especially on the fresh powder days, um, I definitely see the frustration and feel the frustration. But that's where I think my personality comes in and, and being able to show the people, hey, we're going to get to you guys. We'll get you guys up the mountain safely. He says with resorts cracking down on parking, coupled with the desire to keep Utah's air clean, riding a bus up to a resort has gained in popularity. This year alone, uh, we've definitely seen an increase uh, versus with our snowfall last year and the crowds then. Um, definitely an increase in in um, people at the park and rides and at our stops. So while you may be antsy to get in those fresh tracks, remember safety is always first. This year, as an operator, from my perspective, I feel like the flow is a lot better. Um, the, the reservations definitely has helped us um, get people safely up the canyons and just keep the, the flow going. Our buses, you know, do not stop on a dime and so we, we need the room to, to come to a safe stop. Our buses are full, so there are a lot of people uh, standing on our buses, so if we have to brake hard, you know, there, there may be a chance for an injury, so just give us the room that we need to work. and. If you want to ride the UTA bus up or down either canyon, it's $5 each way. If you have a season pass to any of the resorts, it's free of charge. For KSL 5 News, I'm Katia Stepovic.